Bible Definition of Righteousness Welcome to our in-depth guide on the Bible's definition of righteousness. In this article, we will delve into the biblical understanding of righteousness and explore its significance in the lives of believers. Righteousness is a central concept in the Bible, and it goes beyond mere moral correctness. Let's uncover its true meaning and how it is portrayed in the scriptures. Righteousness, according to the Merriam-Webster Dictionary, is defined as acting in accord with divine or moral law and being morally right or justifiable. However, in the Bible, righteousness is not solely about conforming to moral standards. It is about being right in the eyes of God and aligning ourselves with His perfect standard. In the Hebrew language, righteousness is often translated as tzedek or tzedeka, which carries the ideas of justice, fairness, and rightness. In Greek, the word used for righteousness is dikaiosun, which also signifies acting in accordance with God's divine law. Throughout the Bible, numerous verses highlight the importance of righteousness. In the Old Testament, we find examples of individuals who were deemed righteous because of their faith and obedience to God's commandments. In the New Testament, the concept of righteousness is closely tied to the redemptive work of Jesus Christ, who offers his righteousness to believers through faith. Today, the world is filled with different opinions and interpretations of righteousness. Some view it as a legalistic concept, while others emphasize the importance of a genuine relationship with God. As Christians, understanding the biblical definition of righteousness is crucial in navigating these diverse perspectives and living a life that reflects God's character. Key Takeaways The Bible's definition of righteousness goes beyond moral correctness. Righteousness is about being right in the eyes of God. It is a God-centered attribute that believers receive through faith in Christ's sacrifice. Righteousness is closely tied to justice, fairness, and obedience to God's commandments. There are different opinions and interpretations of righteousness in today's world. The Righteousness of Man versus The Righteousness of God by Human Standards Righteousness is defined as being morally true or justifiable. However, the deeper spiritual meaning of righteousness is being right in the eyes of God. It includes one's character, conscience, conduct, and command. Unlike human righteousness, which is based on personal efforts, the righteousness of God is a gift given to humanity through Christ's sacrifice. In comparison to God's righteousness, human deeds are like filthy rags. In the Bible, righteousness is not about conforming to moral standards alone. It is about being right in the eyes of God. The biblical concept of righteousness goes beyond human definitions and requires a divine perspective. It is based on God's standard because He is the ultimate lawgiver. Humans cannot attain righteousness on their own. It is a God-centered attribute that can only be received through faith in Christ's act of love. The righteousness of man is limited and imperfect, whereas the righteousness of God is perfect and unattainable by human efforts alone. The biblical definition of righteousness calls for a shift in focus from self-righteousness to reliance on God's righteousness. It is through faith in Jesus that believers are made right with God and receive His righteousness as a free gift. This understanding of righteousness highlights the need for humility and dependence on God rather than relying on personal achievements or moral superiority. Righteousness of man Righteousness of God Based on personal efforts a gift from God through Christ's sacrifice, limited and imperfect perfect and unattainable by human efforts alone, dependent on moral standards dependent on God's standard, comparatively inadequate supremely righteous the righteousness of God in the Old Testament in the Old Testament. The concept of righteousness is intricately woven throughout the scriptures. It is closely linked to justice, fairness, and God's desire for His people to live in accordance with His laws. The Hebrew word for righteousness, tzedek, carries the meaning of uprightness, integrity, and adherence to God's standards. This biblical understanding of righteousness emphasizes both the external actions and the internal motivations of individuals. One of the key examples of righteousness in the Old Testament is seen in the life of Abraham. In Genesis 15 6, it is written, and he believed in the Lord, and he counted it to him as righteousness. This verse highlights the belief and faith of Abraham, which God considered as righteousness. It emphasizes the importance of a person's trust and reliance on God's promises as a pathway to righteousness. The Lord loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of his unfailing love. Psalm 33 5. Throughout the Old Testament, righteousness is not just about individual piety but also about societal justice. The prophets often call the people of Israel to live in righteousness by treating others with fairness, compassion, and mercy. This emphasis on justice and righteousness reminded the people of their responsibility to care for the vulnerable, the poor, and the marginalized. Scripture reference key verse. Genesis 15 6 and he believed in the Lord, and he counted it to him as righteousness. Psalm 33 5 The Lord loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of his unfailing love. Proverbs 21 3 To do righteousness and justice is more acceptable to the Lord than sacrifice. The righteousness of God in the New Testament. 
In the New Testament, the concept of righteousness takes on a deeper meaning as it is closely tied to the person of Jesus Christ. The teachings of Jesus emphasize that righteousness is not merely a matter of following external rules and regulations, but a matter of the heart. Jesus challenges the religious leaders of his time, saying in Matthew 5:20, For I tell you, unless your righteousness exceeds that of the scribes and Pharisees, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. Here, Jesus highlights the importance of a righteousness that goes beyond mere outward compliance, but is rooted in a genuine relationship with God. Through his death and resurrection, Jesus fulfills the purpose of the law and provides a way for humanity to be made right with God. This is beautifully summarized in 2 Corinthians 5:21. For our sake he made him to be sin who knew no sin, so that in him we might become the righteousness of God. Through faith in Jesus, believers not only receive forgiveness for their sins but also share in his righteousness. The righteousness of God and justification central to the New Testament understanding of righteousness is the concept of justification. Romans 3:21-22 says, But now the righteousness of God has been manifested apart from the law, although the law and the prophets bear witness to it. The righteousness of God through faith in Jesus Christ for all who believe. Here, Paul emphasizes that righteousness is received through faith in Jesus, not through adherence to the law. Justification, in the biblical sense, is an act of God's grace where believers are declared righteous based on the merit of Jesus' sacrifice. Romans 5 1 further explains, Therefore, since we have been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. This means that through faith in Jesus, believers are not only forgiven but also declared righteous before God, restoring their relationship with Him. Biblical Teaching on Righteousness in the New Testament Related Bible Verses Righteousness is received through faith in Jesus Romans 3.22, Galatians 2.16 Believers are made right with God through Jesus' sacrifice 2 Corinthians 5.21, Romans 3.24-25 Righteousness is not earned but received as a gift Ephesians 2.8-9, Titus 3.5 Righteousness is reflected in a transformed life Matthew 7 17-20, Galatians 5 22-23 The righteousness of God in the New Testament is not something that can be earned or achieved through human effort. It is a gift freely given to those who put their faith in Jesus Christ. 